this. You went right through the center top hole down in and got it. So that was the first time we could see him do that. But you can see the size of the bird. And again, this is a varied thrush she caught. It's going to make a very good meal for her, and she's just now getting right into it. She's plucking the feathers, and this is going to be her breakfast. She came here about quarter after eight, and she's been here, oh, 45 minutes to an hour now. Getting close to an hour. So she decided, well, it's time for me to have my snack. Now you can see her long tail and her short wings. That's an excipiter. They fly through the woods and catch other birds. and They're designed for catching exactly what she did here. The Oregon juncos and the varied thrush. They're good for quail. They can even catch a hen pheasant. They're a good hunter. But we did a nest series for the past two years on nesting coopers on the Seuss Creek in Renton, Washington. So if you go on YouTube and just type in RHM Seuss Creek, that'd be S-O-O-S-C-R period, you'll get about 500 movies on the nesting of the Cooper Hawk. We got wonderful movies of the youngsters and the mama flying in and out and feeding them and the parents. So it's worth seeing. It's a very good series and uh, there's about 500 movies on the Seuss Creek Cooper. Just type in RHM, S-O-O-S, C-R period. And you have your choice of about 500 movies. All right, well look at this gal chowing down. Has beautiful yellow legs and yellow eyes. Now her eyes will turn blood red when she gets older. So she's um, not totally mature, but she is a mated bird. And uh, she could be a three-year-old bird, I would think. Or maybe a little less, but anyway. The eyes get redder as they get older, so and she's a very handsome bird, very good looking. She's got the white covert feathers there, and uh, you can see her feet, and see how big she is in relationship to this uh, buried thrush. And this is going to make a fantastic movie of her feeding. Our lighting is really good, and her head just bobbing up and down, just having a good time here. Like I said before, we watched it for quite a while. We were having breakfast, saw her out of the corner of my eye flashed by and then she was on the cage and then she went around several times and oh, three or four juncos got out but she kept watching this buried thrush in there. That's what she wanted. And right in the center on the top, there's an entrance and she popped down through that. So we're all excited about that. She's a wonderful bird and she's chowing down now and her meal of choice right now is the varied thrush. And uh, I never see, see this many times and it's just so exciting because you just see a flash and it happens so fast and of course <laughs> we happen to be home at the time. We got our camcorder out. We're using a Sony with a seven uh, extended zoom, so it's very clear coming in very, because it's just a cloudy day. And like I said, it's uh, about 32 degrees out. And uh, just a perfect day, and now she's having herself a little lunch, a little windy, you can see the breeze blowing. And uh, this is a migratory bird. We're, we're high on the ridge here. My home is uh, right above the, the Cedar River. 